what's going on guys and thanks for stopping by my channel and today's project is this craftsman lawnmower and the problem with this lawnmower is it'll start but then die immediately let's go ahead and show you what it's doing by priming the mower and trying to start it Now let's go ahead and take a closer look at the carburetor and see if there's a problem. And immediately you can see a problem. The carburetor itself is loose. This is more than likely causing an air leak and causing the carburetor not to work properly. Let's go ahead and continue removing the air filter housing and take a closer look. Move the carburetor around and try to figure out which bolts are loose. The bolts that hold the carburetor on are still tight. So let's go ahead and try to figure out what other bolts might be loose. There's a good possibility that the bolts holding the intake tube from the carburetor to the head might be loose. Let's go ahead and remove the top cover and the recoil to find out. And unfortunately, the bolts holding the intake tube were also tight. So we'll have to go ahead and take the carb off and take a closer look at the plate it mounts to. And at this point, you can actually see what was loose. The plate that's bolted to the head that holds the carburetor to the intake tube was loose. And while we're here, let's go ahead and replace the original O-ring with one that's much bigger and will help to seal the carburetor better to the intake tube. I'm not going to just tighten the two bolts to hold the plate down tight. I'm going to go ahead and remove each bolt one at a time and put thread locker on it. And here I'm comparing both O-rings to one another and you can see the difference in size. And here's the bigger O-ring resting against the carburetor and you can see how well it fits. And now let's go ahead and put everything back together again and give it a try. I'm not going to show the detailed reinstallation process just to save time. Thanks for watching Home Garage, and if you would, please subscribe, like, and comment down below. And if you would, please check out my other videos. Have a good one guys, and I'll see you in my next video.